Hey, what's up, boys and girls, kids of all ages? This is a 2021 Chevy Silverado. Um, this past weekend, I had I've got a Pulsar LT on this thing. It's got DFM, which at some point I'm going to turn it completely off. But anyway, this past weekend I made a mistake, and I just wanted to share with everybody so you don't make the same mistake. Uh, I was hauling a trailer. And I didn't put it in trailer mode. And we got up to the campsite. We were goofing around. Got up to the campsite. And this whole dash. All these. Every one of these dials. I'm sorry. Every one of these gauges. <laughs> and the radio. And stuff behind the dash was clicking. Like click, 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 click. Just clicking everywhere. Dials just going crazy all over the place. This was doing all kinds of crazy stuff. And um, I'd heard of that before happening. Um, so long story short, I unplugged the Pulsar LT and then obviously took the negative battery cable off, plugged the Pulsar LT back in and then, you know, put the cable, uh, battery cable back on. Um, and I did something different. Well, and, and when, I, when I did that, obviously it came out okay. It uh, recovered nicely, as you can see. But anyway, another thing that I did while I was sitting there was this thing was on uh, zero stock for the um, for the pedal sensitivity, and I really bought this thing just for DFM. And this is way out of focus. Sorry about that, guys. I literally bought this thing for DFM off and auto stop start off. Didn't even want to mess with that pedal command stuff. Didn't want to mess with the tire sizes. Just auto stop, start off, and DFM off. Well, long story short, I thought, you know what? I'm just going to put it on level three. Zero is, zero is stock. One is 15% less. Two is pretty snazzy. And three is, yeah. Let me tell you something. You just barely touch this pedal, and it's on. And you know what? That's good, because then I don't get into this pedal, and my gas mileage isn't crazy all the time. I felt like my gas mileage was worse when I had it on zero, because I was always pushing into it to get through stop signs and all that. This, man, you just barely touch it, and boom, it's on. And I mean barely touch it. So anyway... I said I'd make that video if anybody has their stuff go crazy like mine did or you really were kind of scared to mess with the pedal sensitivity go for it I'm telling you it makes such a difference it makes it feel like you gave this thing a tune for real even though it's just a pulsar inline make-believe tune just kidding uh, but the, uh, thus far the pulsar has been just fine it has turned the check engine light on twice but I just unplug it negative battery cable off plug it back in and plug the battery cable back on it you know the routine and it fixes it no problem probably needs an up the Pulsar probably needs an update I ain't got time for that bump that stupid thing I'll get I'll get super chips and turn it off when this warranty's over with this is a 2021 Chevy Silverado 5.3 with Dork FM management garbage anyway tip for anybody out there there you go bye